Whenever Nollywood celebrities get political appointments, it often makes headlines due to their fame. Over the years, many popular Nigerian celebrities have been appointed by their state governments and even the federal government to serve in various capacities. In this video, Nollywood Times brings to you seven Nigerian celebrities who have received political appointments. One Nollywood celebrity on our list has served three governors in his state as a special advisor. If you want to know more about the Nollywood celebrity and the state he hails from, then watch this video to the end. Number one on our list is Richard Moffat Damijo, known as ROMD. He is one of the well-known actors in Nollywood. Many were surprised when he was appointed as the Special Advisor of Culture and Tourism to Data State Governor Emmanuel Udoagan in 2008. He later became the Commissioner for Culture and Tourism in Data State in the year 2009. His term ended in 2015, after which ROMD returned to his acting career, his first passion, after serving in the state government. ROMD, as the Commissioner of Culture, organizes many concerts and events to promote the state's cultural heritage. The next celebrity on her list was among the pioneers of music in Nigeria. During her prime, she dated and did a song with popular highlife musician King Sonia Day. Before we get to her turn, if you have not yet subscribed to our channel, please hit the subscription button and like this video. We are talking about no other person than Oyeka Owinu, a veteran Nigerian singer, songwriter, actress, human rights activist, and former X Factor judge, who was a top musician in Nigeria during the 80s and 90s. Later, she ventured into politics with the People Democratic Party. She ran twice for the position of local government chairman in her local government, Idiato, not local government area of Imo State, but didn't win. However, she was appointed as the chairperson of Imo State Council for Arts and Culture by former governor Ikedi Ohakim. On 16 September 2013, President Goodluck Jonathan appointed her as the executive director and chief executive officer of the National Center for Women Development. Oyeka Oweni and Sonia Day almost got married during their time as reigning musicians. Not having time for each other due to their busy schedule made it impossible. Dayo Adenaye, also known as D1, is an entertainment mogul in the Nigerian music industry along with his business partner Kenny Ogunwe. They are known for transforming entertainment in Nigeria. In 2014, D1 ventured into politics aiming to represent Odogbolu State constituency at the House of Assembly. However, he lost in the all-progressive primaries. He was later appointed as the Commissioner for Information and Strategy by Ogu State Governor Ibukule Amosu in 2015, which was a way of consoling him for the loss of the election. Nollywood actress Inkiru Sivanos has starred in over 70 movies and won award for her acting, including Best Actress of the Year as the Africa Magic Viewer Choice Award and Best Actress in a Leading Role at the Africa Movie Academy Award. In 2011, she was appointed by the former governor of Imo State, Rochas Okorocha, as his special assistant on Lagos State Affairs. She later became his special advisor on public affairs. In 2014, she was appointed as the Director General of the Emo State Film Academy. What is the title of the most popular movie acted by Inkiru Sivanos? In the movie, her name was Blair Blair. Let me know your answer in the comment section below. You start a chance to win 1,500 Naira recharge card. Veteran Hollywood actress Hida Dokubo began her acting career in 1992 with the film Evil Passion during her youth service. She has since acted and produced many Nigerian films, including Gone Forever, End of the Wicked, My Goodwill, and The CEO. 
she won an award for Best Actress in a Supporting Role and Best Actress in the Comedy Category. In 2003, she was appointed as the Special Advisor to the former Governor of River State, Peter Odili, and served in that role until the end of his tenure in 2007. Hira Dokubo is a vocal Labour Party supporter in River State. The next Nollywood celebrity on our list did not visit her state up to three times when she was appointed by her state governor as a special advisor. The reason for her not visiting her state or working closely with her state governor would shock you. I shall be revealing that very soon in this video. We are talking about no other person than Nollywood diva Mercy Johnson who began her acting career after her secondary education. She acted movies such as Hustlers, Baby Oku in America, War in the Palace, and some other popular movies in Nigeria. In 2009, she won an award for Best Supporting Actress at the 2009 Africa Movie Academy Award for her performance in the movie Live to Remember, and the Best Actress Award at the 2013 Africa Magic Viewer Choice Award for her role in the comedy movie Dumebi the Dirty Girl. In 2017, she was appointed as the Senior Special Advisor to the Kogi State former Governor Yaya Bello on Entertainment, Art and Culture. She did her job through her phone as she was never on ground in the state. She did not even step on her physical office up to three times during her time. According to a reliable source, the husband prevented her from working closely with the then Governor of Kogi State. Yaya Bello is known to always want to taste from the honey pot of women that work with him. To avoid story that touches the heart, Mercy Josie's husband prevented her curvy wife from going too close to the governor. Veteran Hollywood actor Bob Manuel Udoku has appeared in many popular films including Living in Bondage, Rattlesnake, True Confession, When the Sun Set, among others. He seems to be destined for the position of special advisor to the governor of his state. In 2014, he received a Lifetime Achievement Award at the 10th Africa Movie Academy Award and was nominated for Best Actor in a Supporting Role at the 2013 Nollywood Movie Award for his role in Adesua. In April 2022, the Governor of Anambra State, Professor Charles Soludo, appointed him as his Special Advisor on Entertainment, Leisure and Tourism. This appointment was announced by the Commissioner for Information and Public Enlightenment. Bob Manuel had previously served as a senior special advisor on creative media under the administration of Peter Obi. He also served as an aide to the former governor, Willie Obiano. Is there any notable celebrity who have gotten political appointments that I did not mention in this video? Do let me know in the comment section below. Why these Nollywood actors were appointed by their state governors? Do you know there are actually some Nollywood actors who contested and lost election? If you want to know about the top 10 Nollywood celebrities who contested and lost elections, watch the video that appears on the screen.